We're here with Luke Radowski, wearechange.org. Luke, last time I saw you was at Bilderberg. You've been on your travels, European tour. Just tell us what you've been doing over the past six weeks. We've been very busy just exploring all of Europe, looking for stories, staying with amazing, beautiful people that have been hosting us. It's really just been an amazing experience. And we went to Belfast to cover the G8, uh, went to Dublin, went to Paris, went to Poland, Germany, Holland. We're working on a lot of exciting video stories that are all going to be coming to you on our YouTube channel. So I'm really happy. I'm really excited. We took advantage of Europe as much as, much as we could, took advantage of the cheap airlines and the friendly people here and it's just been an amazing time. And an interesting story emerged out of Poland where you did an interview there about the paedophile scandal that recently erupted. Uh, tell us who you talked to and give us an outline of that story. Well, ever since uh, the threat against me and the attempted setup of me uh, with the child pornography, I decided to take a proactive approach and go after the biggest uh, violator of uh, abusing children, and that was Joris Deming. He's the former Ministry of Justice in Holland who has been caught many times. There's many witnesses, there's many victims, there's many, there's such a huge amount of evidence against him showing how this man is a child, a pedophile, is a rapist of, of children. Uh, and we actually were able to talk to victims of Joris Deming, a politician who is well connected. He's, he's pretty much the equivalent of uh, J. Edgar Hoover and the FBI. Uh, but in Holland, and he's in charge of wiretapping. The story gets extremely complicated, and uh, I'm working on a huge investigation on that. We have a bunch of lawyers we interviewed, a bunch of uh, investigators, a lot of victims, and uh, I'm, I'm really excited to just get that out there to everyone. And there was, there was one victim in particular who you spoke to. Give us a taste of what he said in terms of the paedophile activity that's amongst the elite in that country. We, we were working really hard and we were connected with many lawyers that were working very hard on this case and they brought to us uh, witnesses uh, who worked in the Rolodex investigation which was investigating child uh, pedophilia and child sex trafficking in Holland. One of the expert witnesses uh, was a victim, was one of the children who was victimized, who was uh, used, who was sold in sex slavery and he went into graphic detail about the business he was in and how elites and high people in society, including many different politicians, specifically Joris Deming, he remembers. He remembers his face, he remembers uh, everything about him, uh, came out and said how he was raped uh, by this politician. It was an extremely intense video. I did a separate investigation. Everything checks out that this witness was telling me. I was looking in his eyes. There was no way he was lying to me. It's really just, uh, just extremely hard. It just... I can't even describe it. It was, it was, it was so. Uh, there's no words to describe what this man said. It, it's really insane, and uh, I'm hoping to make this video go viral so people could actually hold this politician, this pedophile, accountable. And that footage is going to be out in the next week or so, is it? Hopefully, in the next week or so. We got a lot of interviews. I'm trying to package it well so it looks really good. Uh, and the video come, should be coming out on uh, youtube.com forward slash we are changed in a week or so. All right, we look forward to that. We're outside the Houses of Parliament in London with Luke Radowski, we are changed.org. I'm Paul Joseph Watson, infowars.com.